This video is brought to you by 3, bringing you 4G at no extra cost. Hey guys, welcome to BTEC. It is Basil here with a Samsung Galaxy Alpha and a Sony Xperia Z3 Compact. Both of these phones record 4K video, so this is a 4K video comparison. We're outdoors, we're testing exposure, shifting, macro focus, and everything else you're really going to want to know. Both of them also have stereo microphones, so they're going to be recording stereo audio. You should be able to hear a plane in the background, so let's take a look at it. We can try and quickly digital zoom on the plane. The Xperia gets us slightly closer. We can pull out. And that is a great entry to test out exposure shifting. So we've got sky and then we've got foliage. Sky and foliage. We can gradually move from one to the other so you can see how gradual the exposure shifting is. And now we can move in and we can see how wide an angle we can get and we can test out the digital zoom in a more controlled environment as well. So in terms of the width of the angle they both look like they're pretty similar um, although the Samsung Galaxy Alpha appears to be slightly wider though that may have something to do with an element cropped off on the Xperia we'll have to test out the final footage to be sure. We can now test out the actual zooms like we said in a more controlled environment and you can see that leaf in the background, the Sony Xperia Z1 Compact is having a Z3 Compact, sorry, is having a little trouble locking focus. And now we can zoom in on the Samsung Galaxy Alpha. And the Alpha doesn't appear to get in anywhere near as close as the Sony as we discovered with the aeroplane. If we pull back, we can also test out macro performance. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna move in front of these leaves right here. Now the Samsung Galaxy Alpha and Sony Xperia Z3 Compact use autofocus but this Samsung Galaxy Alpha has the added advantage of allowing you to use tap to focus to override that. So we're nice and close. We can pull in a little bit closer still and both of these devices appear to be focusing the Sony maybe better than the Samsung. If we were to tap the screen on the Samsung Galaxy Alpha that helps it along with that focus and we can see what we've got in the background giving us some nice background blur and you've got that nice sharp foreground on both devices pulling out until the focus shifts to the background and it's gone on the Sony we're guessing because we adopted tap to focus that's overridden autofocus on the Alpha and in order to switch autofocus back on we'll press the button on the left hand side and then move out and there you go. So autofocus you can switch on manually and off by tapping on the screen. So that has been a comparison video shot in 4K on the Sony Xperia Z3 Compact and the Samsung Galaxy Alpha. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you want to download the full resolution samples, then you can check out the Mediafire links below in the description. You can also see the standalone videos too, and they'll also be posted in the description. Thanks very much for watching BTECT.